Could you go over each of the three functions you've been mentioning, eating, sleeping, and sex, and tell me what specifically, what, uh, what um, rules or hints that you would give people who are seeking spiritual enlightenment to aid in their lives in these yeah. ways? Yeah, that is our book. Mm-hmm. That is our book. We have got enough matter to understand. It is not a thing that we will understand in a minute. I understand you sleep very little. You sleep three to four hours a night. You feel that this is what any person who is sp- spiritually actualized will also realize? Yes. Then you see from the behavior of our Goswamis, they practically had no material necessities. They are eating, no sleeping, messing, and defending practically. They had no such thing. They are simply engaged in Krishna's business. Krishna's business or God's service. He's setting the example of the three previous spiritual masters. <clears throat> Well, what I was interested in is why, if, if, if you found that three or four hours is a necessary time period for them? In other words, why, she's asking why is uh, three to four hours the amount that you sleep, uh, how have you reached that standard? That is not artificially. The more you are engaged in spiritual activity, the more you become Free from material Naturally. That is the test. And so you've arrived at that. that no, I don't speak about myself, but that is the test. Bhakti Prasanu Bhava Bhirakti Anatasya. If you advance in bhakti, in spiritual life, then you become disinterested in material life. Do you think there's a difference between various peoples of the world? In other words, do you think that Indians as opposed to Europeans have more of a tendency or are more likely to adhere to the Krishna consciousness? Any intelligent man can become Krishna consciousness, that I already explained. And unless one is very intelligent, he cannot get to this So, uh, it is open for everyone. But there are different grades of intelligence. In Europe, America, they are intelligent, but their intelligence is utilized for material purpose. And in India, their intelligence is utilized for spiritual purpose. Therefore you find somebody uh, on a highly uh, spiritual standard of life, books, literature. Just like Dasdev. Dasdev was also a householder life, uh, but uh, he was living in the forest and see his contribution of literature. Nobody can dream in So by literary contribution one's intelligence is tested. All big, big men of the material world, scientists, philosophers, even technicians, they are recognized by their writings, by their contribution. 
not by the gigantic body. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Hare. 